either one of these characters in a specific direction well, here. PS2 favors a, like at least something from a lot of characters. Mm -hmm. Like so, a lot of characters don't mind going there yeah. for looking for stage. Because everyone's got a little bit they can do. Here. MC Cola sticking with the Green Roy this time. Okay. Sunido able to get out of there immediately. Now I did say Sunido is an aggressive Sonic, but. This matchup will probably have to run away a little bit as well. He can't afford to, to, to continue to trade with Sword. I mean, just disjoint in general. Solid punish, though. Yeah, already evening the percent back up. Now he get that grab. That forward air is safe. Oh, trying to get the drum the cheekiest. Forward tilt. Get off me. Oh no. What, no punish off of that raw? Double oh no. <laughs> yeah, that was a big slug from both players, but Cola. Did he just shield dance off. a little bit? <laughs> I think, go, go, go a little flexy, I see you. Smart, wow. smart to stuff him out. Oh no. <laughs> see Sunita will try to go for those uh, forward smashes. Okay, up air into forward air, and so much percent racking up right now. Sunita trying to fight his way back. Grabs him, goes for a down throw to send him off stage. We'll see a forward air not connect. Instead, gets beat out by the up special from Roy. That reach is very far in front of Roy. Oh, nice. Quick forward tilt. Able to react to that normal get up from uh, Cola. Yeah, and benefit was, even if he had gone the other way, rolled the other way with it. Nope, yeah, doesn't that's matter. A, that's a <laughs> Those tech chases are really important to uh, mix up what you're going to do. And then, and then instance. Cola covered two options with just a jab. Yeah, and he started it off with down tilt to put you in the situation. That's a lot of the way he's been able to, to fend Sonic off because obviously he's got a grounded approach nine times out of ten. Speaking of down tilt, he's also been using it a lot to stuff out that spin dash approach uh, instead of jab, which is I like a lot better, actually. I wasn't even thinking about down it's tilt. It's a little bit safer, isn't it? And he, I mean, it's going to reach in front of him, and he can shield from it. Yeah, so it, it is safer. Let's see a fourth throw. This man did down tilt after the jab ju just in case. <laughs> just in case he comes in here. So he down a whole stock. Oh, jab forward air. Able to make it back. Ooh, tried to jab there. Unfortunately getting stuffed out by his own down tilt. I love Sonic's down. Yikes. Okay. I, I, uh, yeah. <laughs> Cola, Cola's been on the grind since he lost to Kadali. Cola, Cola has been in people. Aggressively. Money, He's really trying to, like, I think he took a second, recollected his thoughts, and realized, like, there's a tool in Roy's kit for most situations. Even if it's not, like, directly attacking, he has his movement that he's been moving around. And sometimes it's doing nothing and making the opponent come in when you want to. Because once he gets that interaction, he's getting 40, 50 percents like he's, like he's supposed to. Yeah. So I think he took a second, breathed it out. Now, I want to see if Zanito does the same thing because Sonic most definitely has ways of pressuring Roy back. So we're going to Town and City here, and um, I like it and I don't like it because Roy is really good for killing off the sides here. He loves doing Town it. City. Yeah. And uh, I mean, Sonic as well to an extent, but I feel like it helps Roy more than it helps Sonic. And now, the reason I'm thinking Zanito may have picked this is because he has new escape tools to dance around Cola, if he can get to those platforms, as well as chase him higher Trying with that fair again. Yeah, not working out again. And a great high recovery from Cola to avoid the spring. It just seems like everything Sunu is doing to try and stuff out Roy's recovery just isn't working. Oh no. And now it's uh, Cola underneath Sonito. Throwing him off stage again. Yeah, it was look th this beginning of this game was looking really good for Sonito, but evened out by Cola. Now he can oh. Yeah, now he's off stage. No longer has stage control. Now, just now, checking to see if those down tilts connect gives Zanito the option to wait at ledge. Oh, no. An SD from Cola. Zanito's uh, going to take that every 100%, day. hundred percent, yeah. No homie stocks? Wow. <laughs> but don't even. <laughs> <laughs> I thought y'all was cool. <laughs> this is uh, Losers Finals, excuse you. And... Uh, <laughs> Okay. Now, that is what I want to see more of. Zanito's been using the movement now to whip punish Eeks. Yeah, but just this juggling game from Cola, super strong against Zanita. Really struggling to make it back onto the stage and to land. 
Good Pola Trump spacing has been immaculate, as well as waiting on the opponent to do something. I'm surprised Sunita was ready for that Trump because I sure wasn't. <laughs> Baby got... down tilt is just adorable. Like, it's just, no. <laughs> <laughs> you cannot recover here. They can two frame. Uh, what? Goes no. for the downward angle. I feel like the side one would have killed. Uh, very likely. Yeah. A right. little bit safer, though. Maybe a little bit safer. Think that, yeah, the down one is more safer, and... Uh, Definitely doesn't want to sacrifice the stock if he doesn't have to. He knows, again, he can get it when he gets it. There's no need to try and force it. And he got the stock right there with the up tilt. So now Sunito back, trying to answer him, but... A that was an interesting option. Yeah, I think he was trying to go to platform. Mm -hmm. and, then, and then missed it. Yeah, and then, uh, so a little bit of flub from Cola. But, I mean, even so, I think he definitely have the option of a, of a beefy up B of, like, going past it to hit him. But still um, keeping a solid edge guard here. He can't, yeah. he can't hit him with down tilt headline. <laughs> like, he keeps going for it. You cannot hit him. Maybe Sonic Hank's way too low. I don't know. Yeah, Sonic's got actually a pretty good lunch. There you go, racking up some percent with that spin dash combo. So, you know, another homing attack. And now it's back to even percent. And Cola just fishing for something right now and allowing Sunito to get these spin dash combos. About one or two more. Oh, yeah, no, it can't it. be. It can't be, but it is. As soon But I, it actually was. Here's the problem, because if you, <laughs> if you tech in place, Here's the problem, kids. You get, you get jab back air. Yeah. If you tech roll away, you get jab back air. If you, if you uh, don't tech, you get jab, jab back air. And if you tech roll in, you get forward smashed. So well, you, don't, you can't win. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, I think that... Yeah, there was nothing he could do. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to. I'm really trying to find the, the option. That, yeah, don't get hit. Tilt. The down tilts have been helping him for days, especially when it comes to canceling out his spin dash approach. I don't think he should continue to do it at ledge, per se. But, like, in neutral, it has been a great tool for him to get a setup going. You know, uh, Sonino was doing a really great job that last game of being able to rack up damage and finish the stock off. But a lot of that was due to the flubs that Cola was making and the aggressive options he was choosing. So, you know, Cola able to take that game, uh, you know, off of the heels of Sunito. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see mentally, because Cole is, you know, up two games now. Yeah, and, he, and he's looking like having a strong lead right now. Oh, okay, I think he was going for that first hit of air to force a tech. Yeah, I keep seeing him to try to extend his combos with first hit of forward air, and uh, I think all the Georgia players are privy to it, <laughs> and they, they're just jumping out of that. Yeah. But if they, like, air dodge or something, then, yeah, they'll get smashed huge. But they're, they're all ready for it. They've probably been hit by it so many times right A now. A million times now. Okay. okay. Yeah. In his face, but not. <laughs> well, uh, honestly, applying so much pressure just by not doing anything and being in that area. A hundred percent. And making him want to get back to stage immediately. That was the way he got that back air just now. Okay. Gets a grab. Four throw. What's the what's the plan though? I think he wanted a tech chase on the platform, but instead just gonna catch that jump off of ledge with an up air. Which is actually a little surprising. I didn't think that up air was gonna be sweet spot. I definitely knew that it would land. Um, he's doing a good job of calling out these hops from him. Wow, and that double edge dance just beating out the neutral air from Sonic. Sometimes I just miss the good old days when uh, in Smash Four when Roy had a toothpick and the <laughs> sword. You know, the scary part is, like, you, you feel like he can mash buttons, and he feels like he can mash buttons, so, like, he actually can. He can just do what he needs to do. Ooh. Wow, okay, I like it. And that definitely, if that had gotten the sweet spot, would have been it. Well, it, yeah, well, and honestly, I, I was like, new. I didn't think it was going to hit him at all, so he just was waiting Did, yeah, to punt, or even get up. Smart idea. Drifted in and then back out so he could land just in, out of those whip punish ranges. I like the homing attack out of the spin dash and the forward tilt to catch the roll. Got a bit of momentum going on here. Oh. Uh, catching that air dodge back down to the stage. I think he was just expecting a normal get up. Cross ups are real. <laughs> those down tilts on Sonic's ledge hang are killing me. 
And like, even though it's not hitting him, it just puts so much pressure. That's true. But then he's, he's like, I feel like he also realizes it shouldn't. Oh, spring. Oh, I thought he was going to another one. Oh, no. Wow, great Tomahawk coming out from Cola. He's wanted to take the stock right now. The amount of psych outs he just did without even being near this man were scary. <laughs> Back throw will take that wow, stock. Wow. So Nino answered with a Tomahawk of himself. He flew. Wow, weak Nair gonna get into an up throw up air. That's scary. You can't do that on his shield because back air is. Yeah, especially on the back of his shield. No, that sir. Back air is gonna eat Maybe you if you up. were in front of him, Bear probably wouldn't have killed him, but like back air at that type of percent, you gotta be careful with that. All right, back air from Cola. One stock away from making it into winner's finals. Sunita really got to dig deep right now. Oh, I think he hit it. I think he tried to get up. Okay, gets a forward air. Finally gets back off the ledge. And another forward air. Getting a straight going here or no? Okay. Woo! Baby are barely able to avoid all that uh, commotion. Not only that, this man threw out. Oh, there I thought he had the read. Gets the tech roll in, but that was the first time he actually tech rolled in, which I think is the best option in that situation, especially when he down puts you towards. No. Ledge. Well, that's going to be at 3-0, Cola over Sonido. So Cola is going to get his rematch. He's going to get his rematch. We're gonna do you him think a, he's going to, did you think he learned from it? I do. Because yeah. he was really upset afterwards, and he had some time to think, right? Yeah. So he seems to have cleared his head with a lot of these other matches. I have never seen such a press of Roy play um, consistently between Snakes, between Mega Man, between Sonic, and it's been very effective. And it wasn't like he was getting decimated by Falcon, by any means. He was definitely holding his own. But I think the best thing that'll come from uh, Cola in this next coming up match against Fatality is keeping his composure when those 